Before we get started today, I just wanted to thank all y'all that's been interacting with my channel. It means a lot. It really keeps me going. Um, had some, some, some various interactions. One guy was telling me about how Jesus loves me, and I don't know if he was just telling me that just to be nice, or if it was because I, I took the Lord's name in vain in one of my videos or something. If I did anything anything like that, I, I ex please ask y'all to, to excuse me. I, tr I try to get away from the cussing, but for saying, like, oh, my Lord, and that kind of stuff, I, I just can't help it. Um, but I do apologize if it is offensive to anyone. I had one kid. I'm going to get started here just so I'm not rambling. This is Shamari Earls. Just committed to Michigan. I'll, I'll get the school name later. Uh, four star on 24. I have one kid uh, reach out to me uh, saying how he's a sophomore and he loves watching my videos to learn, you know, what what to do. <laughs> do not take my football advice, especially if you're, he, he's a D-back. I, I don't know how to play D-back. I'm not a D-back coach. Listen to your D-back coach. The one thing I think if you're uh, in high school – one thing you can get from watching these videos isn't necessarily what I'm saying, but it's more watching these kids because all these kids play at a high level. And you just kind of see what they do. But as for, like, <laughs> defensive back technique or whatever, uh, please do not listen to me in that regard. Listen to your D-back, coach. But I do appreciate it, you know, seriously. um, It's... I never went out of my way when I played in high school to watch what these kids in high school were doing, like the, the best players in the country. And I really should have, you know. But you got to remember when I'm here, I'm not really evaluating them as a football player. It's more of athleticism and physic, physical, physical aspects, like how big they are and all that stuff. For the real raw football stuff, everything I talk about is kind of more conjecture. I don't understand. I don't know what they're playing and all that, like what the coverage is and that kind of stuff. So a lot of times I'm just assuming. And they say a lot of things about assuming, and not a, a lot of it's not good. Uh, this kid's really good. I can't believe I am just hearing of him now. He is ranked in the top hundred. I don't not big on twenty four sevens rankings. It must be a smaller school he goes to or something because I'm surprised I'm not all over this kid already. But you just see how fluid his hips are. He's he's a defensive back through and through. Uh, probably a corner. Uh, I think he's listed at corner, but it might just be defensive back. I don't exactly know. I mean, even you see him on offense that he's, he's pretty dang good. Uh, this level of competition doesn't look great, but at the same time, He's kind of dominating. And, yeah, it's a highlight tape. You're going to dominate, but he's a lot faster than everybody else on the field. And I had one guy also – Um, I'm not trying to get into the channel too much, but one guy also suggested I did a three-star – do a three-star. Yeah, for sure I'll do three-star. I love it when you all uh, suggest me people. The one thing I don't like doing about the lower recruited players is – I come on here and I'm all positive, right? Like, you watch my NFL evaluations, it's kind of different. I'll actually say an opinion on a kid that oh, I don't think he's good. If I think one of these kids isn't good, I'm not going to say it just because he's a high school player and he's got a lot of time to grow. And if he's – first of all, it's like who am I to tell the, the LSU kid's not a good football player? I'm pretty sure LSU, LSU is more st at stake of the, that kid being a, a good football player than I do. There's a reason they offered him. But when I do my NFL ones, I get a, a bit more frank, I think. You know, there's less time for those guys to develop at the next level, that kind of stuff. But, yeah, feel free to suggest anyone. Just, you know, as long as they're a good player. Because I don't want to come on here and watch someone bad and then I get into it with their parents and stuff. Like, I've had a couple parents <laughs> reach out to me on on uh, YouTube, like, I've, I've, I've had one follow me and then one comment. And it was all positive, because I'm, I'm more or less pretty positive on here. I think you could tell, though, when I'm actually, like, when I actually like a kid. This kid's really good. I, I, I'm, I'm very, I'm never going to know his real frame, obviously, because I don't have access to that information. But if I was at school, this kid's... 
really good athlete. I'm not going to let this one run all, all the way. Uh, I, I'm noticing my f eight minute videos do better than the other one. So I try to keep the highlight video to seven minutes. And let's actually watch this kid now. Um, I'm talking about God knows what. Yeah, so I got him at 6'1", 6'2". I, I think he's he's really long. He's 6'2", easy. And it's not so much the height, I think. It's just the arm length, right? That wingspan. 32-inch uh, arms, 33-inch arms. Um, I'd be very curious to have access to that information. But I do with what I can. Jeez, this kid's got a 13-minute highlight video. We're already on the blocking highlights. So I've seen everything show up right now. Um, the change of direction is great. You know, his hips, he does not look stiff at all. Uh, him coming downhill, I, I'd say he's not that explosive right now that I'm seeing. I'm going to pay attention a little bit more before I'm completely on that. But he's he's got good long speed for sure. Again, I'm not sure about the level of competition that he's playing. If anybody can can either confirm or disaffirm or whatever the opposite of confirm is how good these teams are playing um long speed's one that's kind of harder to gauge based on competition but he looks fast in that regard like track speed 100 meter speed all that hips look real good pretty physical i'd say um wasn't a good tackle there but it's whatever like I said, Michigan, you pick that stuff at the, up at the next level, no, no problem at all. He's got a good-looking frame also, not just in terms of, of the length, but his shoulders. He's got broader shoulders, I'd say, than some of these prospects you watch. I mean, you look at him, honestly, he could pass as a high school linebacker. Definitely not a linebacker at the next level, but I want to see him in some more of these uh, press situations. See how just how physical he is when he's up in the other dude's grill. Uh, I think we'll yeah. I let this run too fast. That's on me. Watch this last one right here. There we asking you shall receive him in press. Um, all right. Didn't really get anything out of that one. Because Thomas Dale was a school. I don't know um, what they compete in specifically. <laughs> I said CB. That's his position, idiot. Uh, VA. VA football is very hit or miss for me. Uh, I feel like they've got good prospects, but I watch I, a lot of them. It's just like they're they're just great athletes, but they're not playing. They don't play great football. I feel like uh, I've seen that multiple times, but. I have not watched enough Virginia football to really tell. Yo, six on the frame, I think. Um, I, I don't think I've given that many kids six on the frame at D-back. He's listed at 6'2". He's actually 6'2", in my opinion. Um, and he's got the, the arm length to boot. You know, there's different types of 6'2". There's guys that are 6'2 with short arms. There's guys 6'2 with long arms. I think he's got long arms. Um, everything physically looks pretty good, in my opinion. Uh, burst. So, one, the explosiveness, I didn't really see. I'm going to give him a six on the change of direction i didn't see the ball skills show up all that much give him a four on that uh four on the physicality i thought he's pretty fast so five on the long speed there um again it's when you watch these v these other prospects that aren't from these powerhouse schools it gets a bit more uh you're kind of guessing a bit more but him at 86 i honestly uh 85 83 so he's got the same grade as this kid this uh cal kid i watched mission VA Dion Lee. um Alabama commit, I think. This kid's a good football player. Uh, Shamari Earls, I just watched. Committed to Michigan. You guys got a good player, man. Um, yeah, I kind of went off on the on the channel. I'm trying to think anything else I got to say about this kid. Yeah, it's it's really I, – I, I, corner's interesting. It's like you need to be there physically. You need to be there ath athletically. After that, you can just kind of coach him up. But you could say that about any position. But, you know, I'm, I'm sure the Michigan – defensive staff will get him right and all that and he'll end up being a good player 
in my opinion. I think he's a good player. Thank you.